we were able to take over an entire settlement within the first video, which is kind of surprising. I didn't think that was going to happen. We got very lucky with uh, a nice bandit encounter, so uh, hopefully we can take over the capital here. But first, we have to choose what we want to do with the settlement. We can either destroy it, sack settlement, which I don't even know, or just occupy it. So sacking would be, we could, we could loot, uh, we could loot it, we can, well, we could kill some of the population, but again, I'm pretty sure that the AI had just settled the city as we walked into it. Um, we're not really doing anything else. Allows your troops to sack the settlement and loot taken. I'm pretty sure that's like eight gold. So that's, that would be, there's no point for that. So I guess we'll just occupy it for now. We'll keep it under our belts. Um, we went after a, a new, new technology at the end of the last video. There's our city capture. Very nice. Uh, this is going to be a little bit more difficult now. I think in order to capital, in order to capture a capital, you might need stronger recruits. I don't think you can just do it with anything. Has this guy been walking? Oh yeah, I have him queued up. He's he's walking over here. Okay, well that's that's fine. And we also got ourselves a. Uh, is this guy like the heir or something? Um, well, we got ourselves another pretty much general. So let's get this guy over here too. I don't know if the war will still be going on. Let's hope that maybe it'll be over by the time. Turmoil. Well, yeah, that that's gonna happen. So I don't think we can we can recruit anything. Well, that was it was worth a shot. So, anyways, we've got our we've got a pretty big army at this point, ready to go. Now I don't think we can attack just yet, and maybe we shouldn't. Well, let's move there. Let's move there, and you know we could always pillage some tiles. Pillaging is a part of this game, and as I said, barbarians are too, which means that yeah, yes. The barbarian, or I guess I should say the bandits. Uh, bandits act as barbarians like in Civ 5. They will pillage the crap out of your tiles, and it's so frustrating. So frustrating. I've got a bunch of money. Before I go further, let me uh, also check in on my capital and say, how's that building going? Good. You got the first military building up. We can go after the next one. I should probably, yeah, I should have opened that up a while ago. Produces bronze for trade. Um, so, we don't really have anybody else that's close by to us, so the game advises... Uh, as our faction, in specific, to not do anything trade-wise. Not in the very beginning, at least. We can go after a palace, um, which that gives us one noble recruitment pool, militia pool, palace recruit, yeah, recruit, I don't know. I don't even know what I'm saying right now. Defenses. I'm going to say we're not going to need many defenses. Granary might be kind of nice to store food. And then, again, this is kind of a trade thing. I've got a lot of money, though. Yeah, start recruiting more people. So I can recruit like a bunch at a time as long as they allow us to, and we just need to keep in mind the unrest and things like that. Um, I kind of want more archers, but let's go with some noble. Let's also make sure that he goes in the west gate. Some noble archers. How many of these can I do? I can't do any more. Dang. All right. Well, let's go with another archer then. At least maybe one more. Yeah. Okay. That's cool. We'll keep it like that. Uh, I can get up another settler in seven turns, which is something I definitely want to do. Definitely going to want to do that. And I guess we'll build this. And we're making 106 gold per turn. This is going to be kind of high maintenance, but at least we'll get lots of population. So let's go ahead and do that. And uh, here we go. So let's try to get these guys to the front lines as fast as possible. You know, we might not even... Maybe we shouldn't... You know what? Let's go attack somebody. Let's wait for, let's wait for the new recruits. That might help out a little bit more. Okay, so here we go. Here's another nice little battle. Again, they're off the hills, and I know that you know terrain definitely has an impact. Uh, in the closed beta, I fought, I had, I had, I had a combat inside of a, we 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 fought in a freaking river. That's what I'm trying to say. We freaking fought in a river, so that was kind of interesting. These guys don't want to have nothing to do with our army. I don't know what they're doing. They're just like, nope, I'm good. I, th I what are they doing? Are you, what's what's going on? <laughs> Oh, are you walking by? You oh, you better not be. I was gonna say, I didn't know if they were gonna capture back their own settlement. Like, what are you guys doing? Yeah, pretty much like this force that I have is just brute, just brute strength. Again, like I said in the last video, they just have sticks. They're just running around with sticks and and like a like a stick board to kind of protect themselves. But that's it. All right, good. So uh, we totally. I don't know how great that battle was. We only, they only killed one of us. We killed 26 of them. So, uh, again, it's going to take multiple attacks to, uh, to do a, 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 you know, a bunch of damage to a recruit like that. What? What is this? Okay, there we go. So how much further, we have to be careful. Are these bandits or are these, is this Chin? 
that is. Oh, there, it's a settlement. Oh, we gotta go after that. That's right. Okay. So let's, uh, that's not good. Okay, let's try to, let's try to cut them off across the river. Now, this is where it's really interesting. This game doesn't, it's not entirely like Civ. Because it has that Total War um, battle mechanic, everyone moves at the same time, which I love. So you kind of have to predict where they're going to go towards. And that's just, it's such a small thing, but as a big Civ 5 player, I really like that change. Um, what do you mean? Oh, yeah, that's right. You guys aren't moving. Um, yeah, I guess we could go fight you again. I guess so. While we wait. So let's let's do that. Now, I don't exactly know... Let's see, who's fighting? Oh, yeah. We kind of knew that. I want to keep in mind that other that other spot. We don't really need to watch this. We already know we're going to we're going to dominate. How'd this go? Where they where they go? Oh, they're moving far. I don't know if I can catch them. I'm going to try. I'm going to I'm definitely going to try. And then uh, how did this how did this time how did this battle go this time around? Uh okay, we only killed 9. They killed 2 of us this time around. Again, terrain does have does does have a pretty big impact. All right, let's uh, let's move over here, get an idea of of what they've got going on north of their city, and I could probably bring my archers to attack from the uh, the southeast. That might be kind of cool. So let's try that. Dang, I don't think I'm gonna catch them. I don't even know if it's worth rushing after them. Well, uh, I feel like I've got better movement than they do. First of all, the settlers do have they they do have a little bit of combat strength. It's not like I'm just not going to be able to absolutely wreck them. That will not happen. I'm not going to wreck the settlers. There's a lot of rough terrain over here, so it will take us a while. Okay, so we need to be careful of this unit. What are they? Looks like okay, bodyguard. Those are very kind of default. Imagine them as just basic warrior units. We can probably take them down. Are they going to come after us? Oh, no. They're going to protect the capital. Again, you can't just walk into the capital like we like we did with the other settlement. We have to... Uh, I think it's because they have these walls, which is a difference. You can't just walk in. So we got we to gotta beat down the walls. Okay. And how about this? Dang. They... Uh, oh. Oh. Oh, we grabbed it. Oh, good. I thought they had a little bit of strength themselves, but I guess, I guess not. Okay. Well, we'll occupy this then. Another thing to keep in mind is that each individual settlement has its own unrest. So this is not a global unrest uh, value here. Just to kind of just kind of throw that out there a little bit. Okay, so um, let's... Jeez, I don't know. Where's my character at? He's all the way down here. Hey, there's... I could encounter this guy. All right, fine. I'll be patient. I'll be patient. Let's wait, you know, one more... Let's wait one more turn. Now, if that warrior chose to attack me... Ooh, who's this? We j oh, that's that's a whole another faction. I'm not sure if they're going to notice that the, the Chin Empire is not doing so well. I don't know if they're going to be like, Hey, I want to get a little bit you know in on this. It's a possibility. Okay, perfect. So we'll be almost ready to go. We also don't need to be in the same exact tile to be engaged in the battle. As long as we're close by. I, I'm going to actually take a chance here. Unable to breach walls. Archer units are needed to breach. Okay, so perfect. We're bringing over archers anyways. Uh, although archers can set fire to the gates. Okay, well, we'll wait. So then, uh, so then we'll stay right here. And we need to keep an eye on this other faction. I haven't met them yet, right? Are they coming after us? Or... Ooh, music just got intense. I'm a little bit worried there. Oh, okay. I don't know. I've never heard that music before, so I, I don't know what was happening. Okay, so here's uh, the dog wrong. They want to reveal our capital. No, that's never a good idea. I, I definitely do not want to do that. For sure. Are you good? Yeah, you're, you're fine, it looks like. What did we loot? Okay, we looted... A little bit because of because uh, we were on this tile, so we we pillaged it pretty much. All right, so here we go. Let's try this again. So let's move in like that. 
and uh, and this should work a little bit better. Also, where is uh, there? You are. Jeez, you're taking forever. Oh, that's right. We want to do the encounter first, though. And uh, we've been good technology-wise. Let's go. Wait, wait a second. Let's check back in on our capital. We definitely don't want to. We can't build any more buildings because uh, I don't have the uh, the economy to build any more buildings. So we're gonna need to wait. We're gonna need to chill for a little bit. I don't think we really need much more recruits. Actually, wait a second. I wouldn't mind. Technically, we can get up another settler in one turn, but I'm, I'm kind of not about that life. I'm not about that, like, super unrest life. So, that's kind of how I'm feeling about this. So, I'm going to take this a little bit slower. Again, because they're within the same vicinity. Actually, I think there's going to be two different combats taking place. I don't know if you're going to attack the, the city itself or what. Alright, well, how's this, how's this looking? They were like bodyguards, so they're not... It's not like they're going to have a huge advantage either. Oh, nice. So the archers are attacking. They're they're shooting back at us, though, so that's kind of not good. But, all right, hopefully we're breaching the walls. I don't even know. We have killed a lot of... They have killed a lot of... I'm sorry, we've got a lot more people than they do. We don't know the actual death numbers at the moment. I wasn't sure. that was It was red, so I was like, oh, crap. Is that how many people have died? 500 people just died from the city siege? Okay, so we got something on fire. That's really good. How's this? This battle's already over. I'm gonna go a little bit faster. Use the hotkey and kind of speed speed this up a little bit. Okay, so, okay, we... We did some damage there. Oh, I think we just got into the city. I think we broke the walls. Okay, and this is the other AI moving in. I swear if they swoop in on this... I'll be upset. This might need to be... This is going to be rated R. This rated G video is going to turn into a rated R video. Um, I am not... I want to see if I can take the capital. So I'm going to say no to this for now. But I might regret that because you were offering my vassalization. So, okay. So apparently we're stronger than the dog wrong. Because uh, they're coming up to us and they want like a, a harmony pact. Which means agreed not to declare war on each other. Um, not block trade routes, things like that. They're willing to give me like eight gold for it. That's not worth it. I'm going to say no to this. Apparently we're stronger. So if we can find, I should probably try to find their, their capital. So maybe we'll work on, cause we haven't, we haven't even done anything with diplomacy just yet. Character, you always have at least one and usually more named characters to control, you know, one of which is your faction's leader, king or emperor. Yeah. So you can have those guys die, which got to be careful of that. You can also get errors, which we already have an heir and a king so far. Characters can be used to lead an army or uh, quill unrest to cities. Oh, we had to keep that in mind. Quell? Quill? I don't know. You can enlist more characters by issuing edicts, but we don't want to do that. So, yeah, we haven't done anything with this. So, let's go up to uh, the dog here. Sub dog. Sub dog. We're trying to get that. Uh... What are we trying to do? I'm trying to find out where your capital is. So, yeah, there we go. Reveal capital location. We down for this? Looks like we are. Yeah, reveal capital, reveal capital. Nice. All right, cool. That's all I wanted. So let's see where these guys are at. Where are you at? Okay, so you're not very far away from here. I don't know if we're going to have... Ooh, we need to be careful. Are these bandits? Yes, they are. Okay, so we've got bandits coming approach, approaching Ben. I can't... Rec oh, can I? Oh, that helps out so much. Okay, perfect. So I don't think I need much. Who's stronger? These spearmen have a little bit more defense. I don't know what I want here. Um, they both can move about the same. Let's get the let's get the long spearman instead of the light spearman. I probably should have popped them up in a different spot, but anyways, let's uh let's protect the city. Let's protect our borders, make sure they don't pillage anything. I can recruit one more, but I don't know if I want to. Can I? Oh, I, I can't. Oh, I could do a noble. But our nobles are kind of unhappy with us. It's not, it's not terrible. It's only 45%. Much worse in our capital. Civil war danger. Noble unrest. Oh, okay. Yeah, it is very bad. Which may lead to loss of... Hey, don't go away. Um, yeah, loss of revenue, disruption uh, of recruitment or outrights of war. That is not good. That is very not good. Um, the only way I know how to bring that down is by... Getting up some. Uh, the only way I can do it instantly 
is by getting some some nobles. Perfect. I'm sorry, bringing just some regular people up into this. Can't hire any more. That's fine. Okay, so let's come this way. And uh, we'll try to, you know, I don't know, bring some reinforcements to fight. If I need to, I'm wondering if, if I sack these cities, if it will help at all. That might not be a bad idea, actually. I don't think I, I you know, I really don't think I need this. But I'm going to keep it for now. I'm going to keep it for now, because cause why not? Okay, so have I done everything I needed to do? I don't even know if I'm like... I think farms should be kind of happening automatically. Let's just make sure, though. Build all my farms for me. I mean, these cities are growing pretty well, I think, so far. Oh, I should probably do the rhinoceroses first. I didn't even... I don't know. I still don't have, you know, a huge grasp over the way this works. The whole, the fo the whole farming thing, at least... It's kind of complicated. All right, so we did all that. Are you happy now? Hint, good. Okay, so we also got up uh, a new technology inside of power. So let's try to go road building. Road building would be pretty nice, actually. Let's go with road building then. It's only gonna take us nine turns. I guess we can do that. And we don't need anything else. Um. Yeah. Okay, we're good. And we can technically build a settler here, but I am choosing not to. Okay, so let's check out our battle report. What's going on here? Only 16 people. They only had 16 people die. We lost 12. We're twice as big as they are, though. So I'm going to try, like, one more, maybe one or two more turns. And if not, then I'll just peace out with them. And I'll get that vassalization. But I think we're going to be okay. Yeah, who are you talking about? Who doesn't have... Oh, you don't. That's right. Okay, because we got the encounter. Okay. Well, oh, do we? It's not telling us I got the encounter. Um, maybe... Maybe not. Encounter opportunity. I have moved here. Okay, well, whatever. I'm, I'm leaving. Did we already... I don't know what happened. I don't even know what happened. Alright, cool. So, let's see what, what this other faction does. Because I'm assuming that they're going to be essentially kind of helping us aren't they these oh these dudes are buff oh we got a problem we got some buff some real buff dudes here uh, are they in thongs too oh these are my kind of men right here these are uh <laughs> these are real manly dudes going out there in thongs you could tell definitely these guys are warriors if i was gonna get into battle like why not like just go out in the thong i'm down well, there you go. That's kind of interesting. Didn't I didn't know that. Let's go a little bit faster here. So we're going to arch the crap out of uh, the right side of the settlement. And see, look, they're going to try to... They're going to try to... Well, they're helping, essentially. Does this bar at all represent how close we are to, to forcing the city to collapse? Let's check out the battle report. What's going on here? Okay, now we're starting to lose more people. What's up with that? I don't know about this. I'm going to go with one more. We'll go one more here. Uh, we got bronze armor finished. Or almost finished. I We actually did not finish it, I don't think. Because it's not it's not completely full. But well, no, whatever, it's, it's totally fine. Um, increases culture. We do probably want to increase culture right now. Um, that is, that is a good, that's a good idea. Okay, let's increase the culture, and let's go one more turn for the city siege. If this doesn't work out for us, then, uh, then we'll just peace out and ask for their vassalization. And then I'll wait for you. I'm gonna wait for the bandits. Uh, I wanna wait for everyone to, to kinda get up together and, and we'll be okay. Alright, here we go. Last time. Yeah, so there's, there's that unit back, back across at home that's just sitting there. That's... What they're telling us it's not queued up for. All right, cool. So I'm, I mean, we we definitely broke through the walls. That's for sure. Siege of Chin again. I don't know if I'm pronouncing that either. I could be pronouncing that wrong too. Along with Zhu, it could be that bad. They did. They swooped in on the city. Thanks a lot, Dong. Dog, not Dong. I guess I can call you Dong too. All right, Dog. We have a problem. In the next video, we're gonna have a very major problem with these guys. We'll talk about it. We'll see what happens. 
I, I knew that that was going to occur. I just had a feeling that they were going to swoop in and uh, and steal it last second. When they didn't even, they weren't even doing anything. Like, they they leached off of our men dying. We're going to have to probably go after them. Um, I feel like we have to, but we'll see what happens in the next one. Thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.